so hey guys welcome to my channel so if you are not subscribed to this channel so make sure that you have been subscribed to this channel and let's get started with the first video of conceptual video of python the earlier video was of introduction so let's get started with the video i will be sharing my ppt so so here you can see i have shared my ppt and i have written that python in english so what is english so i will be explaining some points in telugu so don't uh, make uh, comments uh, so uh, for some of my friends so i will be explaining some points so let's get started with the video without wasting any time so going to the next slide so here what are they in python so python if you want to know python exactly and you are confusing like doing problems or uh, logical thinking or uh, you cannot approach logic for a sum so watch from starting watch from this video i will not waste your time so let's get started uh, python is basically a computer language in which uh, you write a code that will convert python will convert into its own language and it will uh, return some output so that is coding so except that coding is nothing that uh, you have to give some input there will be some processing there will be some output that is the point in which i will be discussing more and more about that uh, input uh, processing and output so entire video is on that so you will be getting about flowcharts what are flowcharts and uh, algorithms so you should uh, focus on that as uh, many of the engineering colleges also tell that uh, flowcharts and uh, algorithms are main to improve the logical thinking and also teachers tell that make tracing part of the questions so you will be getting uh, everything over this uh, uh, series so let's uh, uh, so what uh, you will uh, get so what you will get is uh, i will uh, explain concepts uh, with the help of the questions i am will be not uh, explaining concept by showing and uh, studying that uh, concept so studying the concept will not gain your logical thinking go doing more questions will improve so that is one thing and all videos will be small next playlist will be in a sequence manner one one video will be of uh, conceptual like this and another video will be of practice of the previous video so interested students who are interested they can also join telegram group who are uh, enthusiasts of uh, skill enthusiasts so input processing and output here is the main thing if you are facing problems in doing uh, facing problems in doing problem problems of a uh, python uh, logical uh, approach so first think about this what is there in the program what is said what is said and what is there in the program so any coding program any language includes three parts first taking input processing and output when you do run then it will process and uh, if if you have given any output if you said to give any output then it will give output otherwise it won't so giving input for with an example i will explain uh, think a newborn baby a, a baby who has born newly and you have to assign a name to him that's it you have to assign a name to him because he is an unknown value like that in programming there will be some unknown values any values like a b c a to z and with that uh, you cannot use that uh, at the rate and those all things just alphabets with underscore that is the main rule and these all are like unknowns in programming so what you have to do is you have to assign some values to these unknown values and you can print that print a if you have given like i will explain the next slide so that is regarding input in programming so coming to the processing what you will do when you run when you run the program that in it will say it will process so if you have given a name to that newly born baby after some years when he grow if you call that baby with that name then he thinks in his brain that yeah that's my name so he will go and react according to the uh, what uh, the input has been given that is what processing is so who does the processing in the programming so the software you download or if you are doing in online those are called as compilers that will compile your program and if a compiler does compiles in line by line then it will say we will see it as interpreter so what is an interpreter it checks line by line if any errors occurs in that line then it will go and report it will go and say that this is the error go and check it out so that is interpreter and compiler what is it uh, what it does 
is uh, compiles our code compiles means runs our code and gives output if it's there so going to the next slide without any wasting of the time so it is the first program which are doing without learning anything so in the within the five minutes you have started the first year of first programming so language is very simple trust me you will crack it if you if you watch this video so first program is nothing but as i said give input focus on the three things as i have mentioned on the ppt variables input and the printing output so what happens is variable is here that a and b so a and b print everything c you can see that everything is in a single line so what happens is when you assign a is equals to 5 a is equals to 5 then the 5 value stores in a okay that is called assigning you are assigning a you are assigning a as 5 okay you are assigning a as 5 okay next same you are assigning b as 9 so if you want to now say that uh, print print you have to mention the bracket why bracket without bracket i want to just print uh, this one or play uh, i will write a plus b then it will print should print no as uh, python uh, here where the program languages differs so each programming language has its own method of doing programming so if you want to print a thing then it has some rules that is called syntax so in python the rule is print write print then give brackets and in that bracket you mention whatever you want to do okay so there will be many rules coming uh, so i will be explaining you later as this is the beginning video so i won't want to waste your time and just see you can see over this uh, when i run this so you can run this program in pydroid app in android uh, uh, for android users or you can just go and search in google like online python compiler that's it so here in this video from this video you have to be clear that input processing and output so what you have learned from this video the first video that is nothing but basic uh, variables what are variables how to assign those and everything so going to the next slide you can do now it's your assignment you have to do now now only now itself go to the link in the description go to that online compiler i have given the link also so you go there just click it and go there you do the sum subtraction multiplication and division i have did some i have shown example and you see if you find any errors you can just comment it down or you can message me in instagram or telegram also you can watch the practice python series one for the practicing problems on the basis of video one this video i making problems on the first practicing problem that will be a short video because i will not be explaining solutions you have to do those so that's it for this video the, i think uh, the video has become uh, very lengthy so uh, from next videos uh, the videos will be shorter only uh, i will try at most uh, to clear a concept as soon as possible so that's it you can quit over here go and do those uh, four things and you can go and watch that uh, python practice series one so that's it for this video thanks for watching make sure that you have been subscribed to this channel and share with your friends your thing telugu has not uh, spoken yeah telugu will be speaking when it's necessary very necessary okay so that's it for this video and thanks for watching i have shared i said uh, you have to share this video compulsory